The most common behavioral issue for indoor cats is inappropriate elimination, namely urinating or defecating outside the litter box. The laundry list of reasons why they poop and pee where we don't want them to is almost endless, but for this segment of Pet Care TV, I'd like to concentrate on urinary issues. Getting a cat to use a litter box when it's a kitten is pretty straightforward. Cats are fastidious by nature. In the wild, they bury their scat so as not to alert their prey that they're in the vicinity. Since they are neat freaks, their boxes can never be clean enough or deep enough. I know there are some cats that will use a litter box that's brooming over, but don't risk it. Clean the box at least daily and scrub it out weekly with mild soap and water. While we're on the subject of boxes, most cats seem to prefer unscented clumping litter offered in an open air box. Can you blame them? Who wants to step inside a dark outhouse? Relegate the box to an area that's quiet but easy to access. Cats are territorial, though you may have a totally indoor cat. If you have neighborhood felines that prowl your yard, your cat may become stressed and feel the need to stake out your property as its own. This is accomplished by urinating near windows or doors that lead outside. Medical issues can also result in urine being deposited throughout your home. Diabetes mellitus, liver disease, kidney malfunction, urinary tract infections share the common characteristics of drinking and urinating more. Straining to urinate can be confused with constipation. Owners may notice their cat making frequent trips to the box, assuming the position to defecate. In between these trips, they can be found anxiously grooming their backsides. If you have a male cat with these symptoms, it could be a medical emergency. Your cat may have a urinary tract blockage. Be on the safe side. Take your cat immediately to your primary care veterinarian or an emergency clinic if it's after hours. If you notice your cat urinating outside of its box, the act itself is not indicative of the cause. A trip to your veterinarian is in order. After a thorough physical examination and a review of your cat's history, your veterinarian will need to submit blood and urine samples to rule in or out certain diseases. Whether the cause of your cat's inappropriate urination is between its ears or between its legs, don't ignore the signs. Is your cat using its litter box? Do you need help in determining why it's not? Just ask your veterinarian.